What's up everybody, it's Tyler here from Wine Riot. This week on the Wine of the Weekend, we are doing a Spanish grape called Monastrell. So it's not necessarily Spanish because nobody really knows where it comes from, but in Spain they call it Monastrell, and in France they call it Moudedra. So in France this grape is typically blended. It's blended with Syrah, Grenache, it's called a GSM, or Grenache, Syrah, Moudedra. Uh, you might have heard us talking about that in the past, maybe here. Grenache, Syrah, Mouvedra. And it's typically mostly Grenache and Syrah with a little bit of Mouvedra for spiciness. But in Spain, they do 100% Mouvedra or Monastrell. So while nobody really knows where this grape comes from, it definitely comes from the Mediterranean and arguably the first documentations come from Spain, so it's just called Spanish. So they grow this grape in a few different regions of Spain, but the most famous are a region called uh, Jumilla and the other one is Yecla. And the best thing about Monastrell from Spain is it's crazy inexpensive. Like you can get a really great bottle of this stuff for between eight to $12. You'll rarely find it for more than 12 or 13 bucks. But you're getting a really high quality product. We picked this wine for this week because pretty much anywhere you live in the United States, you're having some kind of weather. On the East Coast, it's cold, it's snowing. What you want in those kind of conditions is something that doesn't cost a whole lot of money because you're probably gonna be cooped up drinking a bunch of it. You want something kind of high in alcohol because that liquid sweater effect. And you want this like bold, fruity wine that kind of wraps you like a blanket. That is Spanish Monastrell to a T. Okay, so typically in this blog, we list three different wines. This time we're gonna do five, but just realize that most of these wines taste very, very, very similar. You're gonna get a big, bold, fruity, dry, high alcohol, red wine. Pretty much every wine shop stocks one of these because they have a great quality and price ratio. All right, first up is the Bodegas Luzon from Jumilla. Again, you're looking for that big, bold, juicy flavors for nine bucks, can't go wrong. Next up is the Juan Gil Honero Vera, also from Jumilla, also around nine to 12 bucks. This one's organically grown. Again, all those big, bold, juicy flavors you're looking for with this wine. Next up is the Bodegas Castaña from Yecla around 10 bucks. This doesn't have a specific vintage, so they blend some of the different grapes from some of the different years, but what you really get is a very consistent wine from year to year, so no matter when you pick this up, it's always gonna taste like the last time you had it. Next up is the Bodegas Castaño Hecula. This one is similar to the last one, but you get an extra couple bucks worth of quality, definitely worth checking out. Bodegas Juan Gil Cuatro Meses, or Four Meses, or however you wanna butcher that in Spanish. This is getting into the higher end of Monastrell at 12 bucks, so you know, getting pricey there, but you're gonna get a little bit more quality for the money. Finally, we have the Bodegas Julia Roche, can't say this, Ijijos Casa Castillo, also from Jumilla, 12 bucks. Again, with every one of these wines, you're gonna get kind of similar flavors. It goes great with steak, Goes great with anything you can grill if you want to brave the elements and get outside. It goes really well with pizza, burgers, pretty much any kind of heavy food that you're going to be consuming in the wintertime while you're watching some TV and waiting for the snow blizzards to pass. You're all set. So this weekend, no matter where you are in the U.S., go out, get a Monastrell from Spain, check these wines out. They'll be a new favorite, go-to, inexpensive red. Cheers.